Hello, it's TJR TV. I am Dirky Dirk. You guys know I'm a melee guy, right? You know it. You know it. I totally am. And so here's the question. I've been trying out some melee, all kinds of different configurations and styles. So Howl Cab is definitely the king. But you've got your Spark, you've got your Harvester. I've tried Skinner. So I've tried Double Harvester Spark. I've tried Harvester with Lances. I've even finally gotten the Cerberus Cab, which I love it so much more than I thought I would. It's really awesome. And now there's just so many choices with melee. Which cab do I use? How many harvesters? How many anything? And I'll tell you, in my experience, they all work. They all really, really work very well. As long as my strategy is the same, it really doesn't matter what I run. It's all good. So I thought I'd do a little video showing melee in more detail. To start with, let's just get some base damage on these guys. Now, you might notice that they have this bar system for everything. So, Harvester does seven bars of damage, whatever that means. And meanwhile, the Cerberus does five damage, whatever that means. And as it turns out, the Cerberus does more damage than an unperked Harvester. So, go figure. So, devs, please just get rid of these bars. They mean nothing. The Boars and the Saws both have four bars of damage, but I happen to know Buzz Saws do a little bit more. So, just give us damage per second, please. Alright, so we did some tests. And first, we just got base damage. Harvester, we're saying 30. Here's the spark base damage. Then I'll get base damage on all the other ones. So a harvester with Howl and a harvester with the Cerberus. And then my favorite subject, what about these Tormentors? It does 50% more damage for five seconds. So what happens if we slap those on? And we know Tormentors stack, but exactly how do they stack? We're gonna find this out with some damage tests. And then there's all kinds of different combinations. So different cab types, numbers of harvesters, number of melee, number of tormentors. So all this stuff, we have to get some data and I'll see you guys in a second. Okay guys, so we have tried every combination of different kinds of melee, spark or no spark or tormentor or no tormentor. Wow, but how do we compile all this data together into some kind of spreadsheet or something? Wouldn't it be amazing if there was someone who could do that for us? Ow! Ow! Ah! Hey, you got something from my friend Coldfire Gaming! Thank you, Coldfire Gaming! Ooh, it's a... Whoa! And there it is, this gorgeous spreadsheet is right here. That's what I'm asking for. So, what can we do with this? Question is, which cab does more damage? The Howl or the Cerebus? So let's start with the Howl. If I've got one Harvester and the Howl, it gives me 75 DPS. Okay, so what if that is a Cerberus? Okay, look at that. The Howl is great because it does more damage to weapons, but the Cerberus is a weapon. Look how much damage gets packed on just from this cab. I have underestimated the Cerberus, my friends. Okay, so second question. How much do all these different melee things do? Let's see. A saw gives you 70. A boar gives you 50 DPS. That's actually a pretty big difference. I wasn't aware of that. The Drezba, quite a lot more. 87.5, but getting more towards the saw. Now the Harvester without the perk gives you 75, which is less than a Drezba. That's just insane. And let's compare that to the Cerberus itself. The Cerberus itself does 70, so the same damage as a saw. Okay, and now let's just see how much does Harvester and Spark do. With this perk, the Harvester does 185, which blows everything out of the water. And one Tormentor, one Harvester does 112, which is still up there, but not as good as the Spark. And remember, Tormentors don't last quite so long. All right, so here's another question. How many Tormentors is equal to a Spark? So here's a Harvester, and let's say this is a Harvester Spark doing 108 DPS. How many Tormentors does it take? Let's see, one Tormentor, two Tormentors, aha, three Tormentors. There's your answer. Three Tormentors is equal to one Spark. Okay, how about on the Cerberus? 
Because you know Tormentor works on the Cerberus too. So let's see. One Tormentor does a lot of damage. One Tormentor, one Harvester, and Cerberus does a lot. In fact, it does more than a Spark Harvester on the Howl. So that's pretty good. That's a lot of damage right there. Let's add one more Tormentor. Now we have unheard of damage. Guys, we have broke the Sparkister. We have broken it. One Cerberus, two Tormentors does more damage than a Sparkister. So how many blue melee equals one Harvester Spark? One saw, two saws, three saws. It only takes three saws to do more damage than one Harvester, one Spark. Okay. Boars obviously take a lot more, so it would take four boars to equal one Harvester Spark. That's actually very doable. How about Dresbuzz? Let's see. One, two, three. Three will highly surpass a Harvester Spark. And now let's do Tormentors. So here's one Saw, one Boar, and one Dresba, plus a Tormentor. Bang, bang, bang. So not enough. Let's see. How about two Saws, and two Boars, and two Dresbas? All right, so adding a Tormentor definitely starts to blow the Harvester out of the water, except for Borers, which don't seem to have a lot of DPS. I'll put three, and there you go. So there's a lot you can play with in this thing. This is a really, really good spreadsheet. I highly recommend you go to the links below and give this a try, everyone. Here's some limitations to keep in mind while you're doing this. The Howl gives you 25% for all weapons, but remember, that builds up over time. It's kind of hard to keep that perk going. The Cerberus, I think, is amazing. It does a lot of damage, especially with a Tormentor. If they shoot the boar, they will take out your cab. So that's pretty bad. Tormentors, I think, are great, but remember, they have a cooldown and they have a time limit. Unlike the Spark, which can shoot for a bit longer. The Spark itself is great, but it can be hard to fire and it can be shot off pretty easily. So if you want to go maximum damage, I'm saying go with a Cerberus Cab. Let's put maybe two Harvesters, a Spark, a Tormentor, and that's 14 energy. That's very doable. 445. That's pretty good. And if you wanted to go for one Harvester, here's a combination. I've got two Saws, one Harvester, one Spark, one Tormentor for even more damage. And let's just get rid of the spark altogether. Let's have a harvester. This is possible, guys. One tormentor, two saws, two dresbas, one harvester, no spark. So that is really exciting. I put my money where my mouth is. And there you go. Two dresbas, harvester, tormentor, Cerberus badness. Looking forward to this little tasty snack. Let's go in. So we dropped power score. We're now below 8k. And we have this monster. Let's give this a shot. It's clobbering time. There you go. Tormentor on. Bam. Short work of him. Dresbas have a lot of health. And that's... I don't mind ramming so much with Dresbas. Hello. How you doing, man? Let's see who wins this battle. Yeah, I'm so glad it's... I'm so glad it's me. Hi. Hi, train plow. Yeah, that'll work. No! Dude! I've got the melee, but people stop me from doing my job. Alright, let's go back in there. Hey, man! Dude, I'm buzzing him. Hello! Here's the ultimate test. Can I destroy treads? I don't know. Let's find out. That'll do it. Alright, victory. Got a lot of points for that buzzing. Alright, so my impressions are a spark is a good thing to have. And I could also use a scanner. I don't even have a generator, so I could pack on a lot more than what I'm doing. Whole bunch of bots over here, and this guy. There you go. Not bad. But I want to get out of here. I really want to get out of here. I want to get out of here. There's a dude. Doesn't see me yet. There! Never chase hovers if they can see you. 
Yeah, don't do it, guys. Don't chase hovers. If you can flat, if you can get him from the side or the back, that's perfect. But don't think you can just chase him head on. They are too maneuverable. Nikki, ow! <laughs> Alexis got me. There you go. A little bit of chewing. A little bit of chewing. Alexis, you gave up on me? What happened? You just gave up? I'm cool with that, Alexis. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. Just totally gave up. Aw, oh, man. Let's just go back and see if the old-fashioned sparkister doesn't work. Here they come. Yep. Hi. There you go. Pretty well done there. Anthony. 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 Get him quickly. There you go. Let's just sneak in there. Joshua, what's up? Whoops. Joshua, I got you. No, I don't. Eee. What's with my driving today, man? I'll tell ya. Dude, 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 dude. Please. David. Come here, David. What a David. David. Tormentor. Got him. And this guy. Dios Hedis. Coming for you. You know it. Beautiful build, by the way. Beautiful little... Uh, oh, I like it. I love it. Love your build, sir. Kind of eat it. There you go, MVP on that one. All right guys, that was a lot of fun. So there's so many possibilities for Melee. Check the link below and try out that little spreadsheet. But I'll tell you, despite having a lot of damage and stuff, I do definitely like having a spark. It does so much more than just pump up the Harvester. So I guess for now, we are pretty much married to Sparkster at the moment. But guys, hope you have fun. I will see you later.